train evolved, it became less and less of a set. It had to be designed to be modular so that we could take it apart in pieces. We could have half a carriage, and we could have a part of a carriage. It's almost like an old theater technology. The train stays in the same place, but we move the stations. The backgrounds move in and move out like an opera. Behind the curtain, we had a station set. It was one station platform, and we constantly turned this around. And those stations would only work for when the train was stopped or starting. Our train could only move like a few feet. That train was pure metal, full of people and lights, so it was very dangerous. So we could only do it um, so many times. Jauma loves to really use the camera. He's a real shot maker. And I was designing a set that was 850 square feet. So we came up with a rig that actually was mounted through the air conditioning. And then the whole rig went side to side and up and down. Then you, suddenly you can shoot all these graceful shots going through without having to resort to all these other things. And it can turn around 360 and never see itself, which is kind of a nice thing. It is a bit of a sort of, how did they do that?